life, street stars. We in here with PMG, Kobe, Bodega, Monstro, what it is. Man, shit, y'all already know what's going on with so this shit. A whole lot so of gangsta shit, a whole lot of street nigga shit. Nah, you know what I'm real, saying? 100, 100. What y'all boys been up to? Give it. Same shit, different roll of tissue, trying to keep this shit jumping. You already know. Now, you been fucking around, man. You got some shit going on, man. You know, you got some shit just, just dropped not too long ago. Little hit. What, what, tell them what the name of it is. Uh, yeah, bitch. Yeah, bitch. Yeah. Yeah, bitch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> tell, nah, us yeah. You, tell us how you came with that, yeah, bitch. That's just my little old. That's my little old shit, man. I was just feeling it. My nigga Mozart did the beat and the shit. And when I listen to a beat, I just, it pretty much write itself. I don't like to rap on shit that don't write itself. I don't want to think too hard and look. So when I first heard that bitch, I was just, yeah, bitch. Now, nah, yeah, yeah, bitch. Uh, that shit, I just flowed in with that bitch. Yeah, Clear Motion uh, Films was on uh, the shooter, man. That, 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 that video looked lit like this nigga just came out there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It yeah, came out whole looking lit like a bitch. <laughs> Hey, man. hey, I always tell, I always tell a nigga that got a song like that, bro. You know what I'm saying? Even though I know, yeah, bitch is kind of hard to, you know, for the kids. But to yeah. get some kids in your shit doing some kind of dance to that shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that shit just might turn up like that, bro. Nah, for real, man. I was just feeling myself. I was just having fun. I can't dance for shit, but a motherfucker better let me think I can. Shit. Nah, for real. I'm gonna cut a rug. Now I gotta ask y'all, man. It's 2020, man. PMG is up, man. Uh, I gotta ask y'all, how did first, and, how did y'all bring in 2020 first and foremost before we can get to the shit? Shit, we brought that bitch in working, man. You know what I'm saying? We go. always working, man. That's one thing we gonna do. We gonna try to keep some shit going. You know what I'm saying? Keep a lot of positive shit going, man. A lot of good music, a lot of good energy. Nah, for real. Nah, definitely, definitely, definitely. Now, Bodega, I don't think the people have met you before formally. Um, uh, so. What is your role? Are you an artist? Yeah, I'm an artist. I'm a whatever. Whatever you know what gotta whatever be. Whatever they need me to be, man. You know, family more than anything. You know what I'm saying? But I got some shit coming out that that I think the folks are gonna fuck with. Hey, man. Cause you know, I first uh, I ain't gonna lie. The first way I I came onto your page is they was fucking with you while you was asleep. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah. damn. I'm like, yeah. they get the, that nigga I mean, ass every nigga, time too. I just this, this is the nigga, nigga, nigga that gets repeatedly time. fucked with. <laughs> You know like, what it is? I be loaded, you know right. what I'm saying? And I just be like, fuck it. I'm wherever I get a little comfortable, I need a little space, I be out. You know Man, what I'm saying? Fuck it. Do you not be like, Low key, kind of worried about going to sleep in public or some shit. Nah, yeah, man. Nah. Like I said, I'd be too loaded yeah, to even nah. think about it. You know he what I'm saying? Fuck, we going right here, goddamn. Yeah, you know. But like I say, he he get me. But I, I'm, I'm gonna get his ass back though, real good, real good. Believe that. Stay tuned. It's gonna be fucked oh, he, up. Oh, he plotting. This nigga. And then Kobe, you know, last time we talked to you, you was just getting out, man, just getting your little first little taste of freedom. Yeah. What yeah, you been yeah, up yeah. to since then? Shit, man, I'm back in the groove now. Back in the groove, bro. Nigga working. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get it, bro. Same old thing, really. You know what I'm saying? So what you been working on? Shit, I got mixtape coming out. You know what I'm saying? We got the compilations coming out. Just dropped the video, War Ready. I don't know if y'all seen that hoe yet. I, I heard the song, I haven't seen the video. All right. Oh yeah, you gotta go see that boy, that hoe straight. Me and Snook on the hoe, my nigga smooth on that bit. I don't know why he ain't come over here, man. He all over there hiding and shit. <laughs> well shit, yeah, man. My nigga smooth on that hoe, Snook on that hoe, that hoe jamming, man. So, on your project that you are working on, you know what I'm saying? Could you talk to us a little bit about what it's called and you know, why'd you name it that? Shit, I'm thinking about calling the whole greatness of weight. But shit, I call it that, bro, because I feel like, shit, I'm destined to be something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I feel like I'm going to be somewhere at the end of the day, so that's why I call that bitch that. You know what I'm saying? That's why I call it that, bro. And let's say I'm just a nigga, you know what I'm saying, and we, I'm trying to figure it out. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's some shit going on in my space, and I'm just trying to, trying to get to the next day. What's going to be that track that niggas need to turn to, listen to, to, you know, get them through? <laughs> Yeah, probably that whole motherfucker. I'm gonna stay on some real shit. I just can't give you no specific track, but shit, most of my shit gonna be on some real shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm from the streets, bro, so most of my shit gonna be on some real shit anyway. You know what I'm saying? So, sure. definitely give you some news you can use, man. Definitely. Yeah. Man, y'all been doing a lot of traveling, you know what I'm saying? Here and there. 
what's the craziest shit y'all done seen is since y'all done all linked up and been together? You know what I'm saying? To get, you know, just mm-hmm. what's what's one of the experiences that y'all just be looking at like, damn, I ain't know we was gonna be getting to do this together. Man, really, the experiences is really all the time. You know what I'm saying? We be places, and I remember them days when we was in the in, the, in apartments. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Just chilling in apartments, and then nigga be like, damn. We sitting here doing this a couple of years ago. We was in apartments thinking no about facts. how we yeah. were gonna do it. Yeah, that's crazy. No facts. You know, uh, even today, man, we um, we posted a clip of you know Yellow BZ came through and hollered at us. You know, what I'm saying he basically gave us a projection and shout out Lil DZ as well, cause he said you know yeah, 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 yeah. with the PMG, you know, he be trying to be co CEO with the PMG and bringing that band, bringing that brand to light. You know, back then he was like, man, I got you know. I got M's in my future, you know what I'm saying? I got, I'm, you know, I want to be able to bring yeah, this yeah, shit to yeah, the next yeah, level. Yeah. To see basically um, from, you know, where the camp started to where the camp is now, you know, for each of y'all, what's, like, personally, what are you most proud of, you know what I'm saying? Like you saying, you know, just how far you came, but personally, when you look shit, back and nigga, look at it. Man. Nigga ain't in the streets, bro. <laughs> see. Now, that's first and foremost, Nigga ain't in man. the streets, see. That's the blessing you know first and foremost. I mean, in any situation, you know what I'm saying, any street nigga, they first prayers to get up out of that motherfucker. Like, yeah. we don't want to be here. We doing this shit to get away from here. Right. You know what I'm saying? We ain't doing this shit so we can look good on the internet. We doing this shit to get away from here. We know that this route is how we got to go to feed our family. You know what right. I'm saying? So we take this route just to jump in and just to dabble in it. You know what I'm saying? Right. A lot of cats don't know, honestly, how much money it takes to, to do this rap shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, for the you know the little white kids sitting at home, they think it's easy. They think the shit just comes. That shit change, costs just come. money, nigga. It costs you gonna money spend like some a, money, like a motherfucker, man. Yeah, you gonna spend some money, bro. And the problem is, like you were saying, uh, in order to spend the money to make it, you got to do some shit to obtain it. Niggas can't. Yeah. It's hard to be at a you know working at Walmart, or, you know one foot in this shit and one foot. You got to be kind of all the way in. So therefore, you know a lot of young niggas they be trying to, they almost got it you know misconstrued as far as how much work you got to actually put in, and how much money you got to put in. And the shit you got to do to get that money, you know what I'm saying? It's, you know, it's blurred lines. But I know y'all got stories and shit as far as what y'all have to go through to get to it. <laughs> How heard, good does it feel to be sitting back now where you could say like, hey, we could at least make moves, whether it's studio time, whether it's this or that or travel, to be like, we ain't got to, you know, check a nigga to, yeah. <laughs> to try to get that bag real yeah, quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, well, honestly, in any situation, we always working. You know there what I'm saying? Go. We going to always be working. We always pushing forward, you know what I'm saying? Just because you at this pedestal, that don't mean you get to sit down. And yeah. that's just like if you hustling and you 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 you, you now you done got to that ten thousand dollar mark, you like damn, I'm finna just start chilling. Nah, you gotta keep that same grind and still be hungry, cause in the day you can go broke. Yeah, quick. The fact that uh, you know we had um we had hit that in here, you know what I'm saying? He you know he fuck with K104 heavy now, and uh, he was part of that you know the era coming up as far as the boogie era. He said one thing that. A lot of Dallas Fort Worth artists, you know, weren't bringing to him was quality music as far as production, as far as just having, you know, the right engineer, the right producer, just making it makes sense. Um, when it comes to y'all's production, when it comes to y'all music, and you know, at the level y'all at now, how important is that for y'all as far as giving that quality of what people expect? Well, in any situation, sound is in any situation, sound is everything. You know what I'm saying? You could have the hardest track out. And if it ain't got no quality behind it, motherfuckers will never hear that shit. They'll never try to even take it in because they like it sound like shit. It ain't nothing they can use. You know what I'm saying? So yes. your quality and where you record and how how much you put into your your art that that that'll get you a long way. Man, they can't play that old distorted ass shit in the club, man. They can't do nothing with that shit, man. It, 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 yeah, man, you got you just got you get what you pay for, man. It's like you don't want your name attached to no bullshit. That's just like in the street. You selling green, bro. You don't want your name attached to the to to the nigga that popping that mid and shit on the everybody. Nigga, you want your name attached to that gas, nigga. So, shit, man, you gotta put you gotta give the best quality in everything you do. Keep a nigga coming back, shit. That's the main <coughs> thing. Yeah, you are what you put out. Now, Monstro. Yes, sir. You seem to be the only one left rocking the shag. And I'm going to be the only <laughs> one left rocking the shag. <laughs> yeah. We ain't even got dog rock, man. I've been having my shit since the eighth grade, man. Since the eighth motherfucking grade. Before, before Yellow had his shit, I had my shit. So mm-hmm. yeah, I'm going to rock mine too. I'm going to be old with the motherfucking uh, salt and pepper in my shit, man. Mm-hmm. My whole mind, damn. 
eventually I fuck around and cut it out, but it's gonna be a long way out. Now recently, uh, not too long ago, y'all had the PMG and um, Cool Money basketball game. Which one of y'all was the sorriest? <laughs> play. I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't no hoop. I ain't gonna even play. With. I ain't gonna do nothing. Get out there and fast. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you like this. I was trying to get them to play a football game, but just because it was a basketball game, I had to get my, you know, give me a little jersey made. I knew I wasn't gonna play. Right. Basketball ain't one of my sports. You know what I'm saying? I'm like an egg. You know what I'm saying? I'll wobble over. Where, where, where that jersey at now? Where you put the hoe at? Yeah, that motherfucker in the trash. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't had no need. I ain't had no need for it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't been hang that motherfucker up. You understand? I see. Body for the event. Right. Now, recently, every TMZ posted. We posted. Everybody posted. The V Live viral chase down of Mo 3's manager. Yellow Beezy hawked him down. Popped him. Monique came up, handed their business. Pretty much. Don't repeat the name. I don't know who Buddy is. Never heard of him. I ain't got shit to do with that. We don't know what the fuck up with that. Not even sure it was yelling in the motherfucking video chasing them down. Know what I'm saying? Allegedly. Allegedly. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm talking about. Allegedly. Allegedly. But, yeah. but I'm just saying, like, she, I mean, she, keep it in the streets. Um, just as a curiosity, uh, you know, with uh, that night, I think uh, May, uh, Mayweather was here uh, in Dallas that night. Um, the city was lit. Uh, as far as, you know, with y'all, when y'all see something like that come up, who who who's y'all calling? Like who who's the first person y'all calling as far as you know to make sure everybody's safe, make sure everybody good, you know whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like are you are y'all even worried about the shit or y'all just like whatever the fuck? Pretty much, I already know that. <laughs> shit, we gonna already pretty much know everybody good. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. nigga, don't be worried about no shit like I mean, that, bro. If, if some shit was to transpire, you know everybody uh, reach out. You know what I'm saying to one another to just let everybody know every. You know what I'm saying. Everything's okay, you know what I mean. It, it it's always a man. You heard about this shit? You straight? You straight? Okay, bet that's cool. So you see, you know, of course with TMZ posting it, I'm looking at it like you know your label mate, you know, Beasley's getting su- allegedly yeah. is getting <laughs> is getting sued. <laughs> Y'all hell, man. Yeah, you know Y'all niggas hell, I'm man. Saying, I'm just saying. Y'all niggas hell, you know, man. <laughs> I don't know nothing, you know what I'm saying? So all I'm saying is allegedly when you see that on TMZ and, you know, I look at it like, you know, damn, Dallas is, you know, it's just the storyline of Dallas and what's going on in Dallas is just getting to that level of we weren't on TMZ before, but we're at that level now and, and y'all are kind of at the forefront of the topic of conversation. Right. Um, how do y'all how do y'all move, you know what I'm saying, with seeing that, you know what I'm saying, and like, you know, how do y'all do y'all move differently or is it just hey, we, yeah, we, we nah. up from here? We street mean, niggas, bro. At the end of the day. We street niggas, man. You know like, what I'm saying? Like I say, allegedly, allegedly, <laughs> allegedly somebody got beat up. Allegedly, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers, that shit really if a, I just put it like this. If a person wasn't at a statue or they was, it wouldn't have been nothing to nobody. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't understand why people wanna you know what I'm saying? Make it out to be something that it ain't. You know what I'm saying? That all the shit really just is childish and dumb. You know what I'm saying? Bullshit. Like, and it's crazy. Like, you want to put people in situations. Come on, man. Like, we grown in a bitch. Like, we grown out here. People got kids to feed. Like, don't be, don't put yourself in predicaments. That's all I'm going to say. Amen to that. So. <laughs> When the last time in the fuck, who the fuck, <laughs> Sue's a nigga, bro? What the fuck, bro? Nah, for real, bro. Look, like, that's, that's just pure Speaking ass. Speaking of bro. Sue, like, nah. Future is suing his alleged baby mama because for defamation of character because she keep trying to put this kid on the nigga. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do you think that, that it, like, is that is that just, if, when well, you have to get the lawyers involved, is that shit you do just to, 
I mean, because in the industry, that's just industry Again, shit. Again, like I say, it's, it's, it's because of a person's stature. Come on. You know what yeah. I'm saying? All bullshit aside, it, like if my man's from the block, like if he get a female pregnant and she, she going to run his name through the mud, like all through Facebook, call him dirty and he don't do shit for the kids and he wouldn't even give a fuck about it. You know what I'm saying? But like you say, you know, when you get to that point, it, it, it'll tear you down, you know what I'm saying? It'll tear your business side down. Like, everything count when you get his biggest future. You know what I'm saying? No facts. That th I, what do you feel about, you know, when you have a white niggas, you know what I'm saying, or white people in your ear telling you how y'all should move, even at y'all level as far as where y'all want to go and what y'all doing on this music shit, do y'all listen to the white man that tells you, hey, here's how you should move you going make, forward? You gonna make uh, the move. <laughs> Gonna make the moves that you feel gonna work for you. I mean, but then again, you know, we gonna hear what they got to say too. Yeah, yeah, hey, yeah. White people, but a little, you know what I'm saying? Okay, yeah, you feel you gonna take it in. Like my granny always said, that you don't never, you can't never learn nothing from nobody. They'll teach you something that you need. You know what I'm saying? Do this. It'll if the money this. right, man, we move. Just put it like that. The money right, we moving, man. We gonna get, we gonna go to the money, man. Now, uh, for sure. The what I love about, you know, the way PMG, Cool Money, Trap, Yellow, all y'all, y'all camaraderie, you know what I'm saying? Like, I seen Trap at his birthday party, Yellow gifted him a watch and a bracelet. I ain't never got shit like that from no nigga. Niggas don't even get nigga a cupcake, none of that <laughs> shit. Like... <laughs> I mean, it's like, like is that this. I, I just, is that a common occurrence? And then I just you know, everybody just seems like everybody's taking care of everybody. Everybody looking out for everybody. It don't seem like it seems like y'all just move as one. You know what I'm saying? It's some of y'all be with some of y'all. Some of y'all. It's just like a big unit, like family oriented. How did y'all get it like that? Because it's never see you never see this many niggas doing this much for each other and. Keep, like, a nigga just always disappear or some shit like that. Well, at the end of the day, man, like, real no real. Real genuine shit gonna always stand. Like, a group of genuine niggas, you know what I'm saying? We gonna come together, like, because at the end of the day, we all got one purpose. We trying to get some money, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, when genuine shit come, it make, it make it be more like a family, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Shit, it's easy. Like, shit, it just flow together. Everybody flow together, man. Niggas on, shit, we been rocking out for some years, so, shit. The, the vibe, the chemistry just, we just flow together, man. You're only as strong as your weakest link, so. No facts. Try to keep everybody on their motherfucking feet, nigga. And uh, Yella himself, you know, he um went out and, you know, bought out damn near the whole Walmart for the kids. Uh, Dez Bryant was in, in the building. Shout um, out my boy Dez Bryant. Yeah, you That's know what I'm saying? Shit right there, man. <laughs> were y'all at that same situation? Uh, were any of y'all at that same situation as far as to, you know, get them all, get all the bikes situated, get all the toys situated? I mean, it's, we, we've been doing little shit, you know what I'm saying, as far as, like, we can manage for years. Like, we've yeah. been, like, over there off Sunnyvale and Overton, you know what I'm saying, Dirt Paris Shopping Center. We've been doing it, like, for years before rap money was even involved. We all throw in some, you know what I'm saying, and try to help the people that's less fortunate. Cause we all come from that. You know what I'm saying? When you come from that, if you got a little and it don't right. matter what it right. is, like if you could do something for the next motherfucker that, that couldn't be done for you when you was a young nigga, you doing something right and you know what I'm saying, you doing what you're supposed to be doing out here. No big facts, big facts. I gotta ask you, you know, PMG, you know, I know y'all, you know, been in been in y'all slew of uh strip clubs, you know what I'm saying? Then then they made the rounds, God damn it! Yes, sir. I gotta ask you though, man. What is your move when you, uh, you, you know, you throwing your money, you know, you're making it rain, and then a female fall out the sky? God. <laughs> <laughs> What's the next move when you? I'll be like, God damn, God damn, y'all seen this shit? <laughs> hey, I'm gonna tell you like this. The, hey. the bitch was, hey, she, hey, <laughs> she was bad. I'm gonna tell you like that. You hit the ground. She was bad for sure. Oh, from 12 it, feet out of the sky. Like and you, and you tip drill all the way to the end of the stage. Bro, she started yeah, pee popping. Yeah. That's, bro, that's. She a gang. She, oh, bro, I know her neck were hurting like a bitch, though. I know her neck were hurting, but she, she hey, a gangster, though. She, mm. is it, and is it just me or did her homegirl not give a damn? Uh -huh, like, they I'm, trying to get some money. Shit. <laughs> nah, nah, nigga. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> she bad hey, she for that. I ain't going to lie. Money, man. 
Hey, the, the nigga. They talking about they gave a go fund. They got a go fund me going for right it's now. Lit. And she, 20, 20K hey, she right. eating like a motherfucker out there. shit. trying to get some money. Man. Out nigga. some accidental <laughs> shit. Y'all gonna have females falling out the car. That shit <laughs> crazy. Don't. I wish she was my girl. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Hey, she probably gonna be famous like, for this yes, shit, bro. Sir. No. She probably hey, gonna be you famous need to go on, this take shit. That's crazy. Cast, Nick. I really. see. Hey, I see no dudes throw no money after that. I think that's why. Like, like, would y'all be like, damn? Would y'all? Like, damn. I got about that motherfucker. <laughs> I thought a nigga broke or something. I got I about there. that bitch. I, I, I got about that one. I would have laughed. Like, hey, I would have laughed. Nigga, she didn't even. I'm talking girl. about like soon as she fell, nigga, she jumped right back up and got the pop in that ass. I say she bad. Yeah, Ooh, she deserves some money for that. I'll tell you like that. <laughs> she she deserves all. She deserve whatever she got for come. That. I'm she glad bad. we we glad she okay. Yeah, nah. First for and real. foremost, we glad her, you know she good. She deserve every little dollar she got coming to. I hope she can retire and you know yeah, walk the walk bad. that yeah, shit yeah. off. Yeah. But yeah. on the flip she side of that, on the flip side of that, you had you know QC. They did the Miami, uh, the stripper bowl, where you know they had a million dollars in ones type situation. So, uh, female, <laughs> females flock from all over the world. They 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 came. They waited twenty hours at the airport just to get there. They get there, and you know you see females. You know I see footage of females sleep, standing around. Some you know they sixteen hours. They leave with eleven hundred dollars. What is y'all? I, I seen a nigga, a nigga pocketed some money. Goddamn it, ran out that motherfucker. Yeah, man, that's that. Yeah, we against that. <laughs> he said, for sure. that, we against we that. We ain't never gonna be doing that bad to where. <laughs> no, we hey, ain't doing no, that bad. A nigga dog. said he was down bad though. Could a nigga be that hey, down that bad? Your rent's due tomorrow. Character, character is everything. Character is everything. Rents due tomorrow. Hey, first of all, we got, it wasn't no million dollars in one. That whole flow would have been covered from end to end. Nah, that bitch was. I mean, I, I mean, I, hey, man, I love you know what I'm saying. I respect that. But at the end of the day, ain't none of my niggas gonna. Be in no club, pick no ones up. Head <laughs> <laughs> not. Can it? Nah, not. But look, it ain't. Hey, bro, you. If I see one of my niggas picking up some, I'ma fire that bitch ass up. I'm not. Oh, bitch, come on, fam. Bitch, come on, that for the hoes, bro. She been sucking that. Hey, come you on, fam. Work, man. Nigga, come on, bro. Money, man. Put the ones down, fam. So y'all don't believe in uh, y'all don't believe in re-rain, y'all don't believe. In re -rain. Re -rain. Don't believe in <laughs> man. Oh, man. My Look. nigga, he got, you got to start dancing, nigga. You gonna pick up some ones, nigga. You got to get on the yeah, phone. Nah, man. <laughs> you might as well go and do a little ben jig not. with the hoes. Ben. That, that might be his hustle, though. You know, yeah. that might be his hustle. You never man. knock a, you never I, knock a man hustle. Bro. I'd hey. rather be a jackal for that. <laughs> nah, nah, for real. So just recently, um, Snoop Dogg got on Gail uh, King's ass, called a fucking dog head bitch for talking about, you know, Kobe after his passing and bringing up his rape allegations. That's that. That's that bullshit. What? Yeah. Was he in? He was Snoop in the right or the wrong? Snoop was out of the way in the I'm, right. I'm gonna just tell you like this, his yeah. word choice. You know, his word choice. His word choice could have been different. You know what I'm saying? But hey, much love man, to the big homie. Nah. But at the end of the day, man, you know, is you why why try to tarnish? You know what I'm saying? The few things that Listen, they let man. us have. You know Everybody think different. You hear me? And I'm a nigga like Snoop. Yeah. I'd have said the same thing. Fuck that hoe, man. She on some bullshit, man. <laughs> you can't say that about that nigga, man. That man did a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people look up to that nigga. You can't. Nah, that's that disrespectful, bro. That. He said the right I thing. I ain't saying he was wrong. It's just like to say, you know the word. So how do you feel about black women getting offended because he called a, a cause now it's like every woman type shit. Like, right. man, man, a bitch, like a bitch ain't never been a bitch think, before. I, don't, I ain't seen no black women get offended by that. I, no, I, I didn't see that. See, cause that whole, she was that's Kobe line, Brown. Uh, Obama's secretary said, and I quote, trust me, you don't want them problems. Cause you no, you don't want this war. Obama said. Yeah. <laughs> you don't though. Come on, man. A woman. Come on, man. <laughs> no facts. Right. You facts. don't want that. Like 
You don't want the women to be a man. What's up, but, but 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 like but like he said though. What about that homeboy? He got the rapes and shit. The white dude. What's yeah, his name? Uh, Wine. Yeah, Wine. Wine. yeah, I ain't saying nothing about this nigga. You know what I'm saying? But y'all yeah. want to say something about Kobe? Mind nah, you, Kobe bro. was acquitted, so nigga, it shouldn't even be really. Yeah, they they, they they hating on Kobe, man. Now, what Ice Cube say on that song, man? <laughs> I told you, motherfuckers, Kobe didn't take that pussy. Yeah, hey, get out that bullshit, man. Now, I gotta say though, <laughs> I, I was watching. Uh, Oprah came. You know, she was. Oprah yeah, came to man. her. <laughs> Oprah came to her defense, man. She was crying like a motherfucker, man. Do, do y'all niggas ride for each other? Like, when nigga come at you, we're like, say, fam, 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 fam. Fuck all that. That you know, whatever, whatever, whatever. Do y'all see y'all, y'all see the bond in that as far as between each other as far as if a, if the world is going against Kobe, but they go you gonna you gonna turn around and go against you gonna turn around and be like, hey man, I know we wrong, but y'all get on my goddamn nigga. You gonna be like, I mean, like I say, you gonna put that nigga to the side of me. Yeah, like if I if I disagree with something somebody doing, I'm gonna let them know personally. Like it's yeah, gonna be just shit. them. Cause I was always taught first and foremost, mind your own business. Like that ain't my man, business. Man. Like that, you know what I'm saying? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a tell you to the side, yeah. Say, bitch, you know you was out of line for that, but I'm a slide for my nigga, right? Regardless, so you know what I'm saying. I don't give a fuck. We shit. I'm a slide for my nigga, regardless, but I'm telling bitch, you know you was out of line for that. Yeah, right is right is wrong is wrong. So, my start tell us, when was the last time Kobe was out of line? Huh? When was the last time Kobe was out of line? <laughs> That oh, nigga look like he that just nigga, that <laughs> down there. She damn near all the motherfucking town. <laughs> <laughs> that, hey, but that's how that's our relationship. Shit, I yes, be sir. out of line too. So shit, hey, that, me and this bitch out of out of everybody. Me and this bitch, we shit, we like. Nah, for sure. <laughs> we be little like, shit bumping heads and everything. But shit, this fifteen years we been mm. rocking, nigga. This this our brother. We brothers. Amen, so, amen. Uh, before we get out of here, man, I just want y'all to go over what y'all got coming up. You know what I'm saying? Just so the world can know what they looking for in the next couple of months, you know what I'm saying? Like any yeah. projects or any any okay. bitch. Yeah, yeah, bitch, shit. Bitch. Uh, I just dropped. Yeah, bitch. Yeah, yeah, bitch. bitch. Go check that out. Shit, I'm finna shoot. I'll bark no bite. I dropped that bitch, and I'm finna. Uh, I'm I'm thinking about a March date on my motherfucking tape, man. I'm thinking about a motherfucking March date on my tape, but I'm finna drop that bitch yet. I'm still undecided on names and shit too. I wanted to call that bitch to get to know me, but I'm still trying to decide. So, but I'm thinking of March date. I got um, I'm finna drop the the box freestyle. You know what I'm oh, saying? Yeah. <laughs> Just give them some PMG shit. You know what I'm saying? Show them how we kick shit on the beat. You know what I'm saying? When we freestyle, video coming out probably this week, and uh, I got that introducing the pot that's gonna come out. Like about March 14th, introducing the pot, Jose yeah. Bodega. That's gonna be jamming too, man. Right in time for South by Southwest. Keep it real to the streets. Nah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's going down, down man. It's it definitely going down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure, for definitely sure. going down, man. For sure. Yeah, Kobe, what, what, what you got uh, on your? Way? Shit, man, I'm finna drop that greatness of ways, man. I'm pop, I'm try, I'm trying to drop two of them bitches back to back. You hear me? I'm working, man. I'm working, bro. Video, visuals. All that shit, bro. It's a bunch of shit. No, no facts. I, and I got to put Yell on the spot, man. Uh, does he, <laughs> all the celebrity friends that he has, say, hey, you know, do y'all ever say, hey, give me, uh, I want, I want what's the name on the track, make that, you know, twist that shit, make that shit work. I ain't did it, Jay. I ain't never did that. <laughs> I ain't pulled that car. Yeah, you ain't pulled that car. Yeah, you, you, ain't, you ain't just trying to pull it. Nah. <laughs> nah, nah I mean, Yell, it's coming. <laughs> I mean, it's coming. Man. You don't just go up to no nigga off the street that that's your partner partner type shit. You know what I'm saying? I done been around, hit the road and shit. So now when niggas see me, they chop it up with me and shit. We building that little relationship before I just coming with a hand out off the street. Hey man, I'm I'm yellow. This and that. Nah, man, I'm gonna tell you like this. Man. This is one of the most important parts of music and it's networking. You know what Amen. I'm saying? Ain't networking. nothing wrong with networking. Like. <laughs> That's what you get out there and do, you network, I, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to lie, I'd have been like, yeah, let's put me in front of Cash, dog. Yeah. Put me in front of one of you goddamn yeah, your hoes. Yeah, networking is everything, <laughs> man, for sure. I mean, shit, being that, that, you never know what's live or the swing through. Amen. Like them concerts and shit like that, they live or the swing so Feet we long way now, walking through the door and shit, so you already in the environment, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It, it's on you. You going to stand in the corner and just play the background or you going to... 
Get out there and work your jelly. Shit. Yeah, because a closed mouth don't get fed. Closed mouth do not get fed, nigga. Y'all got any shout outs? Yeah, man. I want to. Shout out to Snoop. Big homie, man. Shout out to Snoop Dogg for that. R.I.P. Big homie. For real, for real. R.I.P. Big homie. Shout out to GRC gang, you know. A whole lot of PMG family, you know. A lot of good shit, man. A lot of good content finna come out, man. Y'all keep your eyes open, man, and here to the streets. The whole motherfucking city. My nigga J Smooth. Hit that. That's my boy. You know what hit I'm that. saying? Shout out, hit that, man. Shout Epic out, interview. my boy. Hit that, man. And then uh, if they want to get in contact with y'all for any bookings or features, how would they do that? Low D. Z. The nigga who is yet to give us an interview. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That nigga, that nigga's like, that nigga's a Teflon Don. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. If I hadn't seen it myself, I wouldn't know it existed. <laughs> now, so, uh, IG, Snapchat, uh, what y'all fucking with the most? Yeah, I, I know, I know Kobe ain't fucking with you. <laughs> I know Kobe ain't fucking with you. <laughs> yeah, he posts. <laughs> He got a bitch with a poster or something. I mean, hey, y'all stop doing me like that. I'm still trying to know how to work this shit, man. <laughs> Hey, man, yeah, man. Give my boy a couple more months, but it's kind of hard. <laughs> Give him a couple more months, man. Nah, nah. Yeah. You gonna get it together. I be fucking with the Instagram. I just don't post them up, but I be on that hoe though. There I'm start go. posting, man. I'm start posting. Now, hey, while. everybody flood this nigga's Instagram right now. Give me Instagram right now. They gonna I'm flood his shit, shit right now because my shit Jacoby the Great, man. Yes, sir. My shit Jacoby the Great, man. That's my Instagram, Jacoby the Great. <laughs> my shit uh, PMG Bodega Two One Four. You know what I'm saying? PMG Monstro, man. Man, you already know what the fuck going on, man. It's a PMG situation, man. I appreciate y'all coming through, man. It's 2020 is going up for y'all, man. Don't get too big to, you know, not come back and holler at us, oh, man. man Stay that, fucking with man. the fam, never man. <laughs> Real life street stars, you already know what the fuck going on, man. We in this hoe. Hey. <laughs>